And we're back in the game with some more Rome 2 Total War, playing as the Desert Kingdom of Kush. Right, and as the Desert Kingdom of Kush, we are now moving into North Africa to take out these pesky uh, Syracusans who have been unfriendly towards me since the start of the campaign. Uh, we have been concentrating on the south, the north, the east, and now we're heading west. Right. I believe everyone who's moving is already moving. We did recently sack Carthage, but we're not going to stick around. Uh, I suspect these Syracusans might come and try to retake it from us. As you can see, we've got a boatload of money, and a boatload of food, and a boatload of income. So we're definitely not hurting there. Um, Apparently there's no trade route out of Carthage to make use of. If there was, I would try to hold on to it a little longer. Right. We are at war with one of a faction, well, two. Rome and... where are they? Uh, Chimeria. Right. Because I think uh, the Seleucids attacked Chimeria, or vice versa. And we're allied to the Seleucids. But we shouldn't have to worry about Myria anytime soon. As far as our victory objectives go, we've finished our chapter objectives and our active missions. And for a military victory, we do need the province of Africa and Cilicia and Asia but they can be held by our allies. Okay, we will have to recruit more naval units. Now, is it not Galatia that it is holding on to these two regions? I believe it is. Hello, Galatia. Uh, let's see if we can get the military alliance. Oh, let's throw some more money at them. Oh, wrong one. Just to keep them exceedingly happy. So that didn't really make them look very happy, did it? Huh. They normally gain from that, don't they? Something like 11 points. Alright. Now, there was an update to Rome 2 this morning, uh, but it shouldn't have affected any of the actual game files. That was uh, to do with the announcement of Total War Warhammer 3. Right, let's go and end the turn. And then we can hopefully keep on moving. Ah! Ah, what say you? finally, the Romans actually want to talk to us. They want a peace treaty, but they want me to pay for it. Huh. Mm, they must be a bit worried. Ah. Ah, again, look at this. Look at Massilia go. Wow. I've never seen Massilia get this big. They control about half of Iberia. Uh, Southern Gaul, Eastern Gaul, and um, this is Alpine. Wow, really, I've never seen them that big. So Rome is just down to Corsica, Sardinia, and most of Italy. Wow, it's um, pretty amazing. Well, no. Because you've been mean to us since the beginning of the campaign, just like the Syracusans. And you've never wanted peace with us since the beginning, even though we have offered you peace many times. So, death to Rome. Haha. <laughs> even Syracuse now wants peace treaty. Nope. We're coming to take your territory. 
Ah yes, the Syracusans have moved north. Yeah, I'm not paying you for that, Katia Roy. They have moved one army south. Uh, over here, we could actually probably defend this and even win. But I don't even want this territory. I think this uh, faction icon is for Drangiana. Uh, we'll find out in a second because I'm just going to auto resolve it. Yeah, I'm actually fairly confident I could win that. But I just don't want this region out here. So, this faction is going to claim Orea. It's not really worth any money to us. And I believe it's going to be Grandiana. We'll find out in a second. Okay, camel disease. That's not good. Uh, currently in the world, Asian swine flu. Very rampant. But now there's even camel disease. Hmm. Our camel breeders complain about a new disease spreading over the livestock, which is making the beast's fur fall out and seem weak and weary. The caretakers warn us that this malady will soon spread and, left unchecked, could get out of hand. A merchant in a nearby village, no doubt aware of the situation, is selling the cure for an exorbitant price. <coughs> Vaccine companies fetch the cure, spread the disease. <laughs> Let's breed a sound to it. Yeah, I'm not too confident in his actual cure, but just to be on the safe side, we'll go ahead and um, pay for it. Right, we've lost trade with Tillis, which is in the Eastern Balkans on the Black Sea shoreline. Okay, I see any. I've got an, a peace treaty. Okay, where did we lose our sage? That's in our very profitable region of, uh, over here. We're going to have to get another one. And immediately. Yep, tax rate. That's good. Okay, commercial stimulus. Do we have a... Tribute collection. Okay, we'll go with this one. Yeah, we're running out of household items. Okay, so let's go and see why Tillis no longer trade. It used to be over here. Ah, looks like either, yeah, probably Galatia took their territory. Um, maybe they even got wiped out. Yeah, looks like they got wiped out. Ah, the Germans can trade once again. Do not trap them in lies. Apparently it's very low. Alright, fine. Yeah, there it is, Trangiana. Am I always to be disturbed by foreigners? If it is arms you want, uh, peace. Yeah, we're probably gonna go make more money from having a trade agreement with them than we did from the actual settlement. Okay, uh, they don't want the non-aggression. We get some money from them. Uh, we can. Right. Fine by me. They'll probably get wiped out by somebody else. That'll probably turn around unless they get wiped out by somebody. Maria, I think, is expanding. Let's take a look at the other event messages. Yep, we got our piece there. Grandiana, we have encountered them. Yeah, Tillis got wiped out. And our army got wiped out. We didn't recruit anybody. We do have this army out here near Charax. 
Might be time to make use of them. Yep. Should be an auto resolve, I believe. Yeah, basically nothing to worry about. Okay, we almost lost that cavalry unit there. Okay, and Charax is somewhat happier. But they're not going to stay happy. It's actually worth, it's worth a lot of food, isn't it? Not worth much money. No, we still get a little food. I mean, I guess I could put uh, a general in there, or an actual, maybe an uh, admiral, just to balance out the uh, public order. What can we do about the public order? Not really much. Uh, Desert Nomadic is going up ever so slightly. Hellenic is going up a lot quicker and will probably pass us soon. Really don't want to leave an entire army there. How long before they have a never revolt? 20 t uh, 40 turns. Alright, well, that gives us time to decide what we're going to do with them. But very good veterancy, even though these are fairly basic units. Right. We'll send them west. Right, um, spy on moving. Now we've got the spy here. I think I destroyed most of the buildings here because I wasn't sure we were going to be able to hold them. I don't have great replenishment there. We also can't recruit any mercenaries. We can get some slingers. You know what? Uh, how many can we get? Three, four, five, five units. We've got armies on the way. And unless they send any troops over from Sicily, our king might actually be able to hold Carthago. Okay, we failed again. Yeah, this is an actual army. We could get them over here. That might threaten Thapsus, so they have to pull back. Can't travel very far. Right, let's find our other armies uh, way back here. All in forced march stance. Right, so I believe that's all of our armies. Yes, indeed, it is. Right, hopefully we can get a, a battle against this army. It's a decent army. Who's going to be fighting them at first? Oh, we might get to see our elephants in action. They don't have artillery. Uh, they got better cavalry, but they are mainly defensive army. Let's see what this army does, and whether any reinforcements come over from Sicily. I think we're going to get some slums up in Carthage as well. Okay. Um, you're unreliable, so no. 
even though they have a good amount of territory. And it appears to be snowing in North Africa. This would be Tunisia, wouldn't it? And this would be Libya, I think. Ah, they've actually come to attack me. So they have about 500 more men. Right. Well, we're going to fight them. Because this is basically the only Syracusan force left in North Africa. And they're already interested in a peace treaty. Right, they have to come towards me, so... Yeah, let's deploy up here. Standard shot, yeah, we'll go with standard. Uh, don't want to activate the kill elephants button just yet. We have you on flammable and you on explosive. Okay, you are pikeman. some swordsmen down here and some slave swordsmen up here right. hide them anywhere some of these units can actually hide in just tall grass, shrubs. Let's go. getting a bit dizzy looking at them from that angle. Look at them from up here. Right. Our artillery is in action already. Okay. You can't hit them because you're using explosive rounds. Apparently you don't have very good range. Now you do. We want you hitting these more important units. Okay. Our Ethiopian cavalry does not have the skirmish ability. Hmm. Right, who are we facing over here? Citizen Cav, I think. Oh, Desert Cav can beat them. Right, let's see if we can scare them with our elephants. Well, they've gone after our archers. Alright, archers get back behind our lines. Hmm, our cavalry over here did not do very well, did they? Not against those citizen cav. Uh, they are being supported by the 
slingers as well. Apparently you're going to have to chase them all the way around the battlefield. The elephants have done their job. Uh, those, yeah, they are broken, so we shouldn't have to worry about them from now on. See how well our elephants are doing. We'll send our Chotel warriors over here and we're going to have to get our general to take out these citizen cav haven't lost any of our elephants just yet their citizen cav over here did manage to rally uh, they broke broken through the center of our lines But we'll target them with our archers. Right, if we can get our ballista crews away. Now these Syracusan units are pretty steady. They are meant to be a defensive unit. Right, there's their general. Come on, elephants. Ballista crew, get away. It's hard to replenish our ballista crew over here in North Africa. We are taking quite a bit of casualties. Right, come on, General. I think you're going to have to uh, try to help out our main line over here. Yep, uh, our elephants are out of control, aren't they? Yes, they are. Yep, there's a chance that we're going to lose this. We just have to follow up with our other armies. Right. Got one unit that has managed to rally over here. Right. Elephants. Try to kill their general. Uh, that might shock them enough. Oh, their slingers are wavering. Our cavalry actually managed to rally as well. Yeah, we're losing our archers as well.
I would try to get our ballista crew over here. Don't know if they could make it. We don't appear to have any abilities on our general either. Yep, the enemy did a lot better than I thought they would. Alright, about to get a charge in on their general, except for our cavalry just stopped. Yeah, not a particularly good charge, was it? Do we charge them again? We'll try to take out their units. Hmm. Maybe their general is particularly good. Right, those uh, archers have rallied over there. I mean, we still got quite a few bowmen. Oh, they are starting to rout. We haven't killed their general. Let's pull back our general. And we're losing our uh, ammunition. We don't have much left. The general's starting to die off. That artillery crew just isn't firing. Well, we should inflict quite a few casualties. Even if we don't win. Uh, you might as well just get off the artillery and just go and fight them hand to hand. Yep, target those. That's most of our units are dead now. Yeah, get away from those hoplites, General. That's not the best place for you to be. Yeah, all of our units are routing. Yeah, those hoplites are going to be protecting their General. If we can get one more good charge, we might kill him. Ah, uh, they're going to get caught up again. Yeah, we're dying a lot quicker than he is.
Oh, they're doing a good job of protecting their general now. We are more maneuverable. We would think we are. Uh, still too many hoplites on the field. Uh, don't want to charge their pikemen. Just down to our general now. One general for an opening. Well, we got to charge in. Yep, just stay in as long as you can. Maybe you can kill him. Yep, we killed him. Not too many men left. Yeah. Alright, that's the end of the battle. Yep, we killed quite a few of them. They've only got about a thousand left. Our general did well, so did the elephants. Our cavalry did not perform well. Look at this, our Chotel warriors. That's the best sword infantry we have. They didn't do anything. Absolutely nothing. That was pathetic. Even our slave swordsman did consider it better. Okay. Well, I don't think that was a very important general. Although, apparently he did survive. Or she did. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, they can't replenish there. They're not in safe territory. Increased in rank. River monsters. Okay, that's helped out with our income. Good. Okay. We should have a garrison, shouldn't we? Yeah. They're not actually besieging us. Hmm, okay. How strong is our garrison? Ah, that's uh, replenished. That's why they can't do anything to us. Right, well, might as well just go and recruit a couple more units. It's actually worth holding on to Carthage now. We should definitely get a temple in there. Oh, it's probably going to rebel. Let's uh, go ahead and exempt it then. We might come and put a military building in there later on. Swordsmen, archers, and tribesmen. Let's um, add to our garrison. Right now we need the public order, I think. Probably biggest penalty is religion, right? Uh, cultural differences. Is it worth putting a second temple in there? Yeah, let's go for that. Okay, you cannot reach them. You can come up here. Right. Oh, 
see if we can actually sabotage them this time. Right, finally successful. Okay, who increased in rank? Our spy back here. We want the assassinate ability. I guess we can put her in our army for the moment. We need to activate you. Uh, keep you moving. And keep you moving. Right, we've encountered the Odrissian Kingdom. I think they just rose up right where Tillis was. Okay, we've got the Hunter's Bazaar. Public board is still okay. And we put in here that we'll add to our wealth. We still want more money. Money, money, money. This can hurt public order. Not sure if there's a particularly good one there at the moment. Uh, commerce. But again, that's negative public order. We'll be okay. Let's go ahead and build that. Right, well, um, we're going to leave it right there at 666-013 in our treasury. And we're poised on the brink of capturing Apsus. Because I don't think this army's going to get back in time to save Apsus. They might, but they've been heavily depleted. Uh, so, until next time, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you later.